All right, Johnny boy, we're almost to my car. Oh no, my car isn't here. I think someone stole it. Are you sure it's not one of these other cars? It really stinks in this garbage can. Yeah, I'm sure because everyone on this show either has a black car or a silver car, no other colors. My car is silver and there are only red cars and yellow cars here. Ah oh, darn. Too bad looks like your plan has been foiled and you will have to let me go. Fat chance Johnny boy, shut up someone's coming. Oh hi, do you need help with your trash? It looks like you are struggling. Oh, no thanks I can't handle my own trash. Bye bye now. Hey, wait aren't you Kate Howard? Uh, no, I'm definitely not that tighty tighty ice bitch. That's weird because you look just like her. Yeah, well you sort of look like that one vampire slayer. Well gotta go, ta. Well, that was weird. Now where was I? You were going to let me go. Oh, right I was going to steal one of these cars. Okay and now we dance. Spinelli, I feel really awkward doing this. Alright, I think we are done. Thank you Milo for helping me set up my date with Ellie. Can I go now? I need to go home and look at pictures of Lulu. What the hell? Trey, didn't your mother ever tell you not to sneak up on people like that? You are my mother. Oh yeah, right. What do you want? I came to tell you that I'm leaving town with Christina. What did you do, knock her up? Uh, no. I just wanted to tell you goodbye. Alright, beat it. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. Okay, you're acting weirder than usual. No, you are. Look, I didn't come here to fight. Mahum. What was that? What do you have in your trunk? None of your beeswax. Open your trunk, Connie. What are you the trunk police? Just open your trunk. This thing is broken. I must have dropped it on the ground too many times. I have to open it from inside the car. What the hell? Daddy, I don't want you to go out tonight with bitch. Emma, what did I tell you about calling her that? I'm sorry. I meant bitch. Emma. Hey, that's what everyone calls her. Emma, you were pretty crabby today. Maybe you should go to bed early. It's New Year's Eve. You said I could stay up late. Why don't you want me to go out with her tonight? I hate her and she's a mean bitch. I hope she gets puked on and doesn't show up. Emma. Well, I do. And you probably shouldn't drink tonight. Why? Because you'll probably have to work tonight. Why do you say that? Because Connie's on the rampage and I'm sure someone will end up brain dead. Let's face it, Stephen Lars isn't the sharpest crayon in the box. He can't take care of it himself. And stay away from the road where Cole and Hope died. That's where it's all going down. Emma, how do you know all this? Olivia told me. Hey, where's Connie? She left. Where did you come from? We were just leaving the hospital. Connie threw Star into a table at the Haunted Star and knocked her out. I bet she gained a few new fans for that. We were just leaving the gym and Connie was leaving the Haunted Star. I think I saw Tracy and AJ with Lucy leaving the mall. But we all parked our cars in the same parking garage. Yeah, that's weird. I bet this is really a universal parking garage for every place in Port Charles. Maybe this is where they keep the teleporter. Guys, we should probably find Connie. There were noises coming from her trunk. She has Johnny in her trunk. Let's go. I'll call 911 on the way. I am so drunk. Why didn't Ellie show up? Oh, Spinelli. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to crash your date. Who cares? She never showed up. That's weird. So, what are you doing here? I. Um. I'm drunk. Yeah. I see that. What do you want to do? I just want to go home. Okay, we'll go after I pour this whole bottle of $500 champagne off the roof. Help me. Yeah. No, I don't think so. What the hell, bitch? You killed Cole and Hope. Now it's time for you to die. No. Help me. I'm Kate. No, you're not. If I'm dying then you're going with me. Johnny boy help me. She won't save me. Star come on you have to save Connie. Why should I? 
She killed Cole and Hope and kidnapped you and locked you in her trunk. Yeah, you have a point. Bye Connie, sayonara. No. Wait don't leave me. Sonny will kill you, if anything happens to me. Yeah, you're right. We have to save her. Besides she didn't kill Cole and Hope, I did. What? I made her take the rap for it. It's the one memory Kate can't remember. Connie's been keeping it for months. It's all my fault they weren't integrated. You jerk. A little help here. I'm falling and can't hang on much longer. Just let go. You'll drop a few feet and you'll be fine. What? No, why won't you save me? Let go. Trust me, you'll be fine. I don't trust you. That's why we went through all this tonight. All I wanted to do was go to a photo shoot, but I had to tie you up because I didn't trust you to keep your mouth shut. Let go, Connie. No, I don't want to die. Sonny, where are you? Johnny, why are you helping her? She's giving me Bambi eyes and I can't resist and I told you she didn't kill Colin Hope. I did. Let go, Connie. Wow, I am so drunk. I can't believe Ellie didn't show up for our date. Maybe she got hit by a car or something. No, she would have called me. Maybe, she did. I'm going to have a hangover. Spinelli, I lost Dante and Lulu's baby. That's nice. You're pretty. Want to make out? Okay. Hey, I'm fine. She told you. What happened to that little red-haired girl? What girl? The one I saw walking in the middle of the street. I think I hit her. Help Trey just collapsed. What? My baby. No, he better not die. Since when do you care? Why Trey? Why couldn't any of you die? Guys, I just found a red-haired girl on the side of the road. I think she might be dead. I'll go with you. I was going to be a doctor before I started my singing career. But what about Trey? I'll help you, but I never wanted to be a doctor, so I probably can't do anything. It's really nice to be able to eat a gallon of ice cream in bed, isn't it? Speak for yourself, I didn't get any. Sorry. Uh. It's Michael. I wonder what he wants. Olivia, will you marry me? Sure, I will marry you. I've always wanted to be married to a dunce. Now we can be together forever. Uh-oh, you said the F word. That means one of us is going to die. I kind of hope it's you. Gee, thanks. Hello. Oh, there was an accident. I'll be right in. Um, thank you for making me a meatloaf sandwich. They are so good. You're welcome. I wish we could stay in bed, but I think one of your brats will be calling soon, even though it is the middle of the night. Hello, Christina. I thought I told everybody to get the hell out. Well, excuse me. You're four hours late. For what? That sexy photo shoot you wanted to do for the cover of Crimson. What the hell are you talking about? Crimson isn't in publication anymore. Todd took it away from me. Kate. Duh. You're back. Yeah, but only in your dreams. Huh? Want to dance with me? Yeah. Hello, Kate.